And so the Haney test was developed by uh, Richard Haney uh, and his colleagues uh, and aims to be a better representation of a biologically active soil in terms of the nutrients, uh, nutrient availability to the plants. And so this is really important when we look at agric uh, regenerative agricultural systems where the soil health is improved and we have more cycling of nutrients uh, from microbes. Likewise, the uh, extractant use more resembles plant uh, extradition as well as microbe uh, activity. So it should produce better results in terms of uh, the number on your soil test actually correlates what the plant is experiencing in your field. And so when we look at the H3A extraction, that uses three uh, organic acids. So these are acids that are actually produced by the plant. The plant actually releases these organic acids through the roots onto you know, into our soil. That, because it's acid, more or less dissolves or break apart the bonds, making these minerals uh, available to the plant or soil. They come out of the mineral component and available to the plant. So that's the idea behind using these three organic acids in the extraction technique. Uh, they are malic acid, citric, and oxalic acid. These are the acids that plants actually uh, release through their root extradites. Now it's not everything that's released in root extradites, a whole range of different other minerals, but these ones plant use to solubilize um, minerals in the soil. 